me right outside until Paige is ready and then I get called in and then we have a baby. Max has a sibling. We don't know if it's a boy or girl yet. Heads up. <laughs> so we'll see. I'm not nervous, you're nervous. What's the words to the song you're singing? Uh, Ready? Huh? Let's go. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving. Guys, I'm vlogging again. How great is this? Hey. Sure it's good. She just got her hair done. She's got bangs. Can I can I give you a breakdown of what I've eaten so far today? Sure. Okay. Started with two pumpkin bars. You really do look nice, Taylor. How many followers do you think are gonna watch this? I don't know. Do you want to give out your handle? At Taze O'Brien. Is that for Tinder as well? Or? A quick breakdown of everything I've eaten so far today. Two. Handmade pumpkin bars from your mother, Stacy. Then wash it down with a bagel at the turkey bowl earlier. I had orange chicken and rice. It was left over from the Panda Express feast we had last night. Still feeling the bloat. So I've eaten all this already. I'm not sure it's looking good for me. Did for you weigh yourself before so we can see how much you gained? I weigh myself twice a year, otherwise I'm triggered. So I'm going to pick up my mom for Thanksgiving. My mom is 78, which, you know, young at heart, but you know, 78, not exactly a spring chicken. So, um, you can read more about that in my book, Happy People Are Annoying, available here. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna go pick her up because her eyes aren't the best, but what she lacks in vision, she makes up for in spunk. Hi, Babs. Hello, Josh. How are you, dear? Oh. <gasps> I'm so lucky. Because I've been dying to know. I couldn't. Oh, come on, Josh. You have to have one. I am. Okay, I am. You gotta try the rugula. Happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much. Can you explain what rugula is for the Gentiles? It's a dessert made out of nuts and raisins and yummy things rolled into a pastry jug. So I think it originated in Poland, but who cares? It's so delicious. <laughs> Unreal, right? Very good. Hundred dollars. Hundred bucks? Well, who paid? Me or you? I did squash. Yes. <laughs> you liar. Okay, but I said I would. It's like we're in an orphanage. Feels like it. All of us cleaning up. A really nice orphanage run by the Four Seasons. Oh, Max, that's a lot of processing. <laughs> Blake, what are we thankful for? Being my sister-in-law one being, day. Being the only, one of the only people that can say hug me, brother, and actually mean it. Why do you have to do it like that? <laughs> I'm trying to move on. It was 20 years ago, goddammit. I got you, boo. Okay. He really likes when I go like this. I don't get it. Yeah, this is shy, guys. He's pretty cute. He likes this. 
This is kind of our go-to thing. I'm basically like a human metronome. Look at that head control. Look at that neck control. I mean, the pecs have strong necks, but you know, this is pretty outstanding. Is that such a parent thing of me to like find the one thing to be proud of already? Like, my baby has a really strong neck. Don't worry, Shai, I won't show you off too much, but I have to give the people a little something. I mean, you're just so cute. I won't show you off a lot, but oh my. Excuse us. Bro. Thank you guys for having me. I don't yes, think of I course. Said that, but of course. Thank you. You're you're more than welcome. It's an anytime. honor. Our first guest. That's amazing. Uh, so well, it was Jeanette McCurdy, but she made us. Can that's it. true. It was her. <laughs> she made us. Can it? For Wait, what? <laughs> And I'll get Actually, to my wedding and idea. We're going to talk about it. She, her, and Josh were sitting together on a plane. She's like, "Love to come on your podcast. Talk about my new book." We did a whole episode. It was amazing. Afterwards, she's like, "Yeah, I didn't feel comfortable. You guys yeah. are going to need to cancel it." Oh, and it was, no. an, it was. By the way, who couldn't feel comfortable with us? Yeah, I we're know. The good guys. This, this is great. We're as comfy good guys. as you could get. We had a wonderful interview. She was great. By the way, awesome. she was great. I really just think that she didn't want to give us this level of press. <laughs> because then she started doing like, not Ellen, but like like Ellen. Okay, like yeah, big, she was big story. Trevor yeah. Noah. And I just don't think, Trevor Noah. Yes. And I just don't think that she wanted all the juicy gossip to come through me and Jeff. Damn, that would have been a huge episode. It was. I mean, and we could have said, hey, you agreed. You know? Yeah. We have it. Yeah. It's going. Yeah. But then we wouldn't be the good guys. Correct. Uh, we're good, so we killed it. Yeah. But we're going to talk about it until the end of time. <laughs> yeah. We'll juice what we can from We will. <laughs> we will. I just want to say, as an aside, while I have you to myself here, Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday. I mean, yeah, there's some top-tier Jew holidays that I'm a big fan of. Hanukkah, Sukkot, Purim, which is just Jewish Halloween. But more important, shout out Kanye. But more importantly... Thanksgiving is great because there's no press. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's no gifts. It's just like low-key, let's have a meal. Yeah, the origins of Thanksgiving are highly debatable and some might say rooted in some you know, slightly evil sh But nevertheless, whatever we've created now, hundreds of years later, is kind of a nice time. First part about Thanksgiving is you don't stop drinking. Oh, God. What's wrong with you? Mazal. Oh, you want to host? Mazal. 